Hi guys, in this video today I'm actually using my phone as a camera. Uh, I'm not set up for my camcorder unfortunately, but hopefully I'll be able to get enough decent footage from this uh, phone to show you these new two tubo turbo door paints that were sent to me kindly for review uh, so what i've done is i've primed all these really cool bases from dark art miniatures they're actually necro bases or necron for necron miniatures or whatever other cool miniature you want to put on them uh, i'll put a link uh in the comments field down below to dark art miniatures and you can check out their really cool bases um but yeah, so I use those bases for the, the, the test of these turbo dot paints. And we'll just start with, say, Sakura over here. So this is uh, Sakura. And uh, the really cool thing about turbo dot paints is they have an agitator in each of the bottles, which helps um, mix up the paint. And it also has a guide on the side telling you exactly how to apply the paint. So here it says, shake well before use, of course. Must be applied over a white undercoat. Important. Uh, you would have thought most metallics would be black. But no, a lot of these paints are white undercoat um, uh, to be applied. Paint in three to five thin layers, whether they're brush or hand brush. Now, they do say that these hand brush, and I do agree that you can use a hand brush, but for best results, you want to use an airbrush for these paints, to be honest, guys. And here you can see um, the Sakura paint. Now, I've done this just with two layers, not nowhere near as many layers as... Uh, is required for the best results so don't take this as the best results but even so it looks quite nice so that's a sakura uh, then we've got the tarot again you'll get the guide on each of the bottles whether it's a base coat with black or whether it's a base coat with white and here you can see that here a lovely lilac -y, light metallic color now, a lot of these new ones from Turbo Dork aren't colour shifts. They're just metallic paints. Uh, this one is Matcha. I hope I'm not butchering these names. They are really cool names. And here you can see Matcha. Really nice. And as you see, as I angle the uh, cool base, you can see the... Uh, metallic color transitioning from a lighter green to a darker green very nice uh, and then we have got uh something maguru hope it's maguru we're calling it maguru anyway uh so uh this is maguru lovely metallic here we go then we have got um whoop. Let's focus. Yuzu. And then this one is actually a prismatic colour. Uh, a colour shift, I should say. Uh, and it's called Prism Power. And you might be able to see it slightly shifting into a more of a purpley hue. And more of a pinky hue. There we go, really nice colour that is. That looks so cool on a cyberpunk mini. Uh, then we've got uh, Momo, which is like a coppery, orangey metallic. And then we have got twin sons now i think this would be used for alpha legion now i could be wrong guys i mean you tell me if you think this would be a good color for alpha legion it's got that greeny bluey tinge to it and i can see a whole army of alpha legion in this color looking really cool 
um, but let me know in the comments field down below what you think of twin suns but i really like that color one of my favorites uh, speaking of one of my favorites i've left some of my favorite ones till last this is laser face what a cool name and check this out guys wow look at that it's like a, um, a speckledy star dust effect sort of thing i don't know it just looks really cool but yeah, I love that colour. And last uh, colour is uh, 4D glasses. Now, I'm not sure if I've painted this one right. I left this one to last because it left like a... I don't know whether it's meant to look pearlescent. Uh, at certain angles and, and like a whitey color and then green or i've uh, sprayed it too heavily or i've not sprayed it too well but this is one of my least favorite colors in the set but like i say i might have sprayed this one incorrectly um but uh if you if you've got this paint and you've got better results than me with this one let me know but like i say it's probably user error to be honest on this one but um Going over all of the paints, really nice. My favourites are always going to be the colour shift paints. My two favourites of the set are definitely Twin Suns and Laser Face. Uh, but you let me know what you think of the tur Turbo Dork paints uh, in the comments field down below. Sorry this is not being edited um, like my normal videos, guys, but I've got so much to do. And Christmas is coming up as well and you know what it's like guys so anyway thank you for watching this turbo dork video and i can't get my words out video <laughs> thank you for watching this turbo dork review and uh, i'll catch you in the next video